to create the trees, we need Blender and M3 add-on. I'm using Blender 2.83 because I couldn't get it to work in 3.6 or 4. But this is only to create the trees. Later, we can export the trees in Blender 3.6 or 4. So the version I'm using is 2.83.9. I leave the links in the description. Now for the add-on, we need modular tree and here select Blender 28. Click on code and download the zip file. Now open Blender 2.83. And to enable the add-on, go to Preferences, Add-ons, install the zip file, and make sure to check the box. Now let's open M3, click on New, in the side panel, click on M3. If you can see it, just press N. And now we can select from three presets. I'm gonna select Old Oak. Now click on Load Preset. And just click on Create Tree. Here we have the nodes for the trunk. This is for the branches. And this one for the smaller branches. I'm gonna change the branches amount to 450. And we need to hit update to take effect. Or we can enable auto update. We can also randomize the tree with seed and also change the length, the radius. I encourage you to play with all the settings so you can make the tree you want. We can also add roots by pressing Shift A, add roots node, and place it here, and you can play with the settings. Now to create the leaves, again press Shift A. And this time add to node. Now click on execute. And this will create this object. Here in leaf type, we can select a different leaf. Just click on execute again. Now to add the leaves, Click on create leaf. And choose the amount. Now select the twig. Change the leaf size. I'm going to increase leaf spread to 0.8 and also leaf weight to 0.1. Now I'm going to export the tree to Blender 4. Just select the leaves, then the trunk, 
and press Ctrl C to copy. Now in Blender 4, press Ctrl B to paste it. I'm going to switch to Cycles and add an HDR image. Click on Render Preview. Also activate Transparent in Render Properties. Now open the shader editor here. And create the material. But first we need the Node Wrangler add-on. Just search Wrangler. Now select the shader and press Ctrl Shift T. And select the PBR textures for the trunk. Now in edit mode, press U and select cube projection. We can repeat the texture. Now, if you want to export to another software, first you have to convert the leaves to actual mesh because right now we have instances, a particle system. So to convert it, press Ctrl A and select Make Instances Real. Now this will create individual objects for each twig. But if you click several times, you will see that the original object with the particle system is still here. So I'm gonna delete it. I'm gonna hide all the objects by pressing H, except the lips. Now select all the lips, hold shift, select any object, and press Ctrl J to join them. But be careful, because this will create a high poly model, as you can see here in the polygon count. So I'd recommend to lower the amount of branches and lips to reduce it.